in Windy, uh, Chicago Lane. I rode all over Clint Boyer's race car and got a top 10 out of it. I might go by there and scratch a thing if you wanted again today, Wendy. Well, maybe I should be riding on Marcus Ambrose's car because that will bring him good luck, maybe. We're talking about uh, riding on cars and what luck it could bring. What kind of luck can we get for you today, Marcus? I, I think the rain, we had a slight window. It started to rain again. What can we expect? Give us your outlook. Well, I need all the luck I can get. So if you've got any advice, please let me know. Um, I'm not sure what's going to happen today. The fog's are starting to roll in now. So, you know, we want to get this race in. I think we all want to race today if we can. Um, track's going to be different regardless if we race today or tomorrow with all this rain on the track. It's going to change the setup, so who knows what's going to happen. Fantastic finish for you in the spring of six. That's a great day. What can we do to make the same results for your team this weekend? Oh, I don't know. Um, you know, it was a great day for us here, the first Pocono. It took me about 100 laps to really work out what I was doing on the track and the fuel mileage thing came into play. But we ran top 10, top 15 for most of the day. We had a good car speed. But we brought back the exact same package for this year's, for this week's race, and it didn't handle it all in practice. So, you know, we're, we're on the run here trying to find out what we need to do to make our car better for the race day. And, and I have a bad habit here of just overdriving all the corners. So I'm, I've been telling myself all day, just, just back it up, back it up, don't over brake, don't over slow the car. You need to go onto your sponsor's website then. <laughs> well, that's right. We've got a a bad looking car this weekend it looks great iRacing.com and they've actually got this track on their simulator and we're really excited about how you know we're helping you know race fans be able to race uh, against guys like myself and Dale Earnhardt Jr and we've got a special this week $25 you get three months membership plus they'll throw in the COT for you and it's just a lot of fun if you're a fan of racing and you want to go racing yourself log on and go iRacing because it's a lot of fun and I do it to get better as do a lot of professional drivers. They go online to really hone their skills. All right. Thanks, Marcus Ambrose. And I did check out the simulator. They had it in the media center one weekend for us to try out, and I was quite impressed because I finally got a good feel for a race car. You know, I don't hop in these cars very often, but it really did help for me to get a feel for what they're feeling in that race car. Marcus Ambrose will start 18th, Johnny, when we finally do get this race in at Pocono.